Now it's not very often that you see traditional style shotguns on this channel but every now and again something impresses me or I like the look of it and I think to myself mm, yes that that looks nice or it feels nice or it performs nice or all of the above so I think to myself do you know what that needs a bit of air time so let me introduce you to sorry guys I'm dragging it out again let me introduce you to the Webley and Scott Pro Comp. Check this out. Oh my God. Look at this. Fully adjustable. Over and under shotgun. Wow. I've also got the wooden version. If there's a bit too much metal there, they do do a wooden version. Look at those. Oh my God. And what impresses me the most about these shotguns is the price. Here in the UK, they are around the £1,300 mark for a shotgun that has got a, I'm going to say, a custom style grip and all that adjustment, fully adjustment, fully adjustment, fully adjustable for length of pull. cheek piece is adjustable you've even got an adjustable weight here that moves up and down wow 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 for under i'm going to say just under 1500 pounds in the uk well under 1500 pounds here in the uk what is not to like seriously turkish walnut absolutely stunning stocks <laughs> All right, these ones are in right hand, so not really very comfortable for me, but super comfortable for you weird right handers. Super, super comfortable. Look at that. Gorgeous sort of checkering on the pistol grip there. I'll just show you the forend. Loads and loads of checkering. And Cerakoted metalwork. So the metalwork isn't going to scratch very easily. It's certainly going to be weatherproof because that's what Cerakote is all about. Absolutely tough as boots, the metalwork is. They are just stunning. I'm really, really impressed with these shotguns. No, I've not had a go of them yet. No, I probably won't be having a go of these because, like I said, their right is and I can't really sort of accommodate them with my left-handedness I'll probably end up breaking my thumb um, like I said left-handed ones are available for special order and amazingly they are the same price so you left-handed shooters if you want something like this it's fully adjustable they are available I think there is an eight week um, turnaround for a left-handed one it is a special order. These are brought in by uh, Highland Outdoors here in the UK. So lefties, you haven't got to worry. You're not being left out. But aren't these nice guys? Like I said, if you don't want all that adjustment there, you just want a little bit of adjustment, then the wood version, which is a little bit more uh, classic in its lines and a little bit more elegant but if you want something's totally adjustable and that you can you know adjust slightly for different types of shooting you know whether you're doing sort of skeet or uh, down the line or whatever you guys all know better than me you know i'm an all-round shooter i'm not sort of specific on one discipline but i think this will really suit your needs i'm going to move this one over there a bit because I don't want to end up clanking the barrels. Not that it'll matter. I mean, Cerico, it's not going to scratch, is it? But now I better not. Let me strip one down for you and just show you it in a bit more detail. And also, it'll um, just be a bit more easier to handle as well. Let's break it open. Rack, what are you doing? You're, you're stripping a gun down on camera. 
I know I should be able to manage this one. It's like three pieces. Right, let's show you this bit in a bit more detail. So, soft recoil pad there. Really, really nice. A slight bit of uh, texturing on there. Adjustable, as you can see here, the whole thing can move that way or that way, if that makes sense. Uh, length of pull you can adjust. There are spaces in the box. You've got this weight that moves up and down as well. So you can sort of adjust the balance of it, so to speak. You can adjust the cheek piece as well. Uh, again, I think you have to put sort of shims in there, which are in the box. Check out that awesome checker in. Check out the checker in. Webley and Scott's logo on the underside of the pistol grip. Gorgeous woodwork. I love the blue as well. The blue really sets this off. Uh, there's your Tang safety catch with select selectable barrels as well. And then talking of the barrels, I think this one is in 32 inch um, extended chokes, full set of chokes, which are easily identifiable. Uh, I believe these ones are, how do they identify these? I think it's written on them actually. Yeah, they made it, they made it nice and easy and written it on. Okay, rather than looking at sort of notches and whatever. Front bead sight there, uh, sorry, front, Fiber sight there, rear bead. Jeweling on the metal work there, ejectors. Very, very nice. Very nice indeed. There is the, um, the fore end. Okay, thick woodwork. No weak points there. They might break off. I've seen that before with shotguns. That is a Nice chunky lump of wood there. Really, really nice. Ample checkering on that forehand. Really, really nicely made shotguns. Let me show you this one. I think this one is a 30 inch barrel on this one. Uh, oh no, that's a longer one. Okay, I'm just comparing it to this one. Sorry, 30, bit, 30 inch barrel on that, and this is the 32. Let's break it open, make it a bit easier to manhandle. I'm trying not to knock it on anything. Pro comp on the action there. Nice trigger blades as well. Like I said, I've not, oh God, oh, 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 I'm knocking it about. I've not shot the shotguns. I will do, not these ones, but I will have a go of them sooner or later. Nice wide trigger on there. Uh, is it a metal trigger? Yeah, metal trigger guard, sorry. Very, very nice indeed. Let's pull that back, put it down before I do any damage. Nice high rib as well. Uh, I like the uh, ventilated rib. Looks sick, looks really nice, really, really nice. You do get a decent box as well with these uh, with these shotguns. Uh, Webley and Scott's uh, tough hard case. Okay, and it is all sort of um, cut out for the shotguns. Obviously, you've got to have them in, in bits in, in here, but you do get uh, these are the shims and spacers that I was on about for um, setting up this shotgun um, just how you want it. Uh, full set of chokes like I mentioned. There we go, they've come loose but yeah, nicely, uh, easily identifiable chokes. There's your choke key. They're in like a separate Plastic box, which is nice. Let's have a look at the manual. Owner's manual here. Oh God, the smell in here, guys. I can smell the linseed oil that's on the stocks. Oh, it smells lovely. Oh, I don't know, small things, eh? Um, decent manual, all your usual do's and don'ts, how to load the shotgun, uh, how to uh, 
select your appropriate choke. A uh, bit of a breakdown on the uh, parts, bit of a, would we call that an exploded diagram? Yeah, well, it is what it is. Nice, nice, not bad at all. So a decent box rather than a cardboard box, but aren't they pretty guys for the price? It is amazing, absolutely amazing. Beautiful, fully adjustable, especially this one. This is the fully adjustable. Um, shotguns for under uh, £1,500 here in the UK, well under £1,500. If you are in the market for a nice target shotgun, clay busting shotgun, and you want that adjustability, you're not going to get anything like this for the money. Um, you know, if you, you look at bigger makes, I say bigger makes, no, that's wrong wording. You look at other makes, you know, with some a setup like this, you know, custom uh, pistol grip, um, all the adjustment, big, big makes, uh, bigger makes are going to be asking probably twice as much money. Okay. So. But no, guys, just thought I would introduce you to the pro comps from Webley and Scott. They look stunning. I can't wait to have one. The weight of them, saying, mentioning weight, can't wait. But the weight of them, as in heaviness, yeah, this one is, she's a weighty one. But that's kind of a good thing, depending on, you know, Clay shooting is going to soak up the uh, recoil, definitely. But this one, you know, you can adjust how you have it weighted. I mean, you could actually take that weight off or you could add more. You know, it's um, it's however you want to set it up. I mean, this, this might be an ideal shotgun for an instructor, for example. So if you instruct clay shooting, then you need a gun where you can set it up for that shooter that you're instructing. That's got to be a good thing. So... I guess shooting schools might be interested in something like this but no very very impressed guys there we go the webley and scott pro comp shotguns very very nice i am going to leave it at that thanks for watching guys that is rack and load see ya